Welcome to another live stream watch long reaction. Tonight we are watching and reacting to Toronto FC versus Sporting Kansas City MLS week six of season 2024. If Toronto wins, they tie their win total from last year in all comps, not just MLS, in six games. Shows how much better the seasons went. Can they win without Insignia is the question. I say they can. We'll find out, though. How are we doing, Henry? Kansas City hasn't had that good of a start of a season. They've got six points, one win, and two, three draws. But they haven't played too well, Kansas City. So we'll find out how this goes. Of course, the new kit. How are we doing, Rory? How crazy is it that Toronto will be able to tie their win total from last year to not if they win? Funny how the Timbers still have that DeBella logo in the intro, but they aren't wearing the ad on their jerseys anymore. You think they'd edit that intro? I'm sure you can with the technology we have nowadays. It's funny how, like, the away team just wears track jackets, but the home team wears regular old clothes. Starting 11, Luca Galvan, Sigurd Rostead, Kevin Long, Shane O'Neill, the midfield four of Tyree Spicer, Alonzo Coelho, Matty Longstaff, Jaquiel Marshall Ruddy, and the front three of Jonathan Osorio, Federico Bernadeschi, and P Prince Owusu. Davy Flores on the bench, which... I mean, Longstaff has played well, but I don't completely agree with. Sporting Kansas City, Tim Melia, the back four, Tim Liebold, Robert Volader, Daniel Rosero, Jacob Davis, the midfield three, Eric Tommy, Nemanja Radoja, Remy Voltaire, the front three, Daniel Shallowy, Willie Agata, and Memo Rodriguez. Are most of them gone from whenever we went? Johnny Russell, I think he's hurt. But most of them are no, gone. No, Tim Mealy is still there. I said most. Yeah, Shallowy's still there. Melia's still there. Okay. I think four, Russell's still there. Four yeah, four or something. Yeah. yeah. Wow. I think Roger Espinosa retired. <laughs> I think he did. Federico Bernadeschi, the player to watch for TFC. And, of course, besides Oso, everybody on TFC changed out from when we were there in Kansas City. Because... Ooh. Eric Tommy, player to watch for Kansas City. How are we doing, B. Kale? Yep. I mean, he's that talented. Awesome. Let's remember, Kansas City was a team who knocked out St. Hey, Louis in the playoffs. Care, man. If it's good, it's good. No, I, I agree. That was pretty good. Teams are walking out. Kansas City wearing their sky blue hoops. TFC wearing their red. Of course, they're not wearing this the first time I wear it. I mean, they're playing at home, so I guess I'm not too mad about it. But <laughs> I don't like when, when teams wear away jerseys at home. But it would have been sort of nice. No, that would be backwards today because you're not supposed to do that. That's yeah, but MLS whole, teams don't really care. But that's the whole point of home and away. It, that's stupid. <laughs> so, I mean, unless you had a backwards day. Well, technically, the Cowboys wear their away jerseys at home. I, 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 then that's stupid. <laughs> it makes no sense. It's supposed to be one and the other, or, really. That's what it started out to be true. in all sports. Or most sports that I know of. But over. now, since you have such a big sell jerseys experience, you know, you try to wear the new jersey as much as you can, especially in the first couple of weeks. Of no, the no, no. I'm not saying that you shouldn't have wore your new jersey. I'm saying expecting them, expecting a different outcome than normal is usually not going to happen. So they were going to wear red or whatever they're going to wear. True. But it wasn't going to be that. 
that's a cool jersey and I know why you wore it and I agree with you. That's not what I was saying. I didn't expect it. I just thought it'd be funny. There's a difference. Oh, that would have been funny if they would. If they chose that. to. That's that's the difference is what I mean. I didn't expect it. Right. And it's more in, in soccer it's more of a clash thing. Yeah. It's like if your colors if your dark clashes with another team's dark, you wear your light. It's more well, that's why you're like supposed that. to have different uniforms. We did that in football. You don't want two people wearing maroon playing each other because the quarterback's not gonna be able to pick up his own players or the or the soccer yeah. players. Yeah. But then you have Texas A and M, Mississippi State play each other and it looks like a damn scrimmage. Yeah, well, that, they shouldn't do that. That's that really hurts everybody. But like one team wears white and maroon, one team wears maroon and white. They both wear Adidas and boring jerseys. Yeah, but one's white, one's maroon. You couldn't have two with the same color maroon. Well, on my point saying. is, is during a Mississippi State scrimmage, you have the other side wearing white jerseys with maroon numbers. Mm -hmm. If you're the away team, you're that team. Or the home one of the other side wears maroon jerseys with white numbers. That's my point. It looks like a scrimmage. <laughs> when it's TAMU versus State, it looks like a scrimmage, my point. Right, right. Which maybe that's why the training jerseys for some teams are just gray, or like part of their training jerseys are just like gray and white, mm. if you've noticed. Funnily enough, it seems like the training well, usually jerseys. Usually in football, you wear the same stuff. You just put a mesh, Penny. different color thing over, yeah, whatever it's called, and that's what we did. And you just, you know, if everybody is purple, you put on a pink one. I mean, it, but it's the same sleeves under it. It's just yeah. the, the main body. You can tell the difference in the players. But if you notice, like when subs are warming up, you see them wearing pennies. Or like when they're warming up together, half the team wears a penny. The other team just wears the training shirt. Yeah, but I don't know if that... The main players are in their uniform. They're in the pennies, you call them. And then... Some are not, so does that mean they're probably not even getting in the game if they don't have? I'm talking them? about like at warm ups, like before the oh, game. If you've you. noticed, like half the team just wears the training kit with regular shorts, the other team puts pennies over their training kit, like I for training you. extra. Yeah, yeah. And I guess it's training as well, but I'm waiting for the game to start, of course. It started out quick, but it sure took a nose dive. Yeah, yeah, I think. I mean, we timed it good. You turned it on, they did their shit, and now it's it's. Of course, commercials, commercials until they're commercial. ready to kick off. We could be at halftime by now. Toronto two nothing. That would be nice. No, but they they. I'm calling it halftime. Toronto two nothing. Right now, I'm doing it. You know, I could see Tyree Spicer scoring two goals. I didn't say who. I just said two. I know who it's coming from. You think you know. So, it's going to be two nothing and a half. I could see it. TFC has a plus three goal difference this year. Fifth in the East. 6.95 expected goals. End of the game. 3-1. I could see it. I'm calling it. I could see it. How we doing? Put it down. Two games, that. wins at that. home, one, one, and one on the road. Oh, by the way, the real refs are back, too. Guido Gonzalez, the referee, Kevin Terry, the VAR. We have the real refs back. It's not scra uh, scabs anymore. They just, Pro and PSRA, just agreed to a new CBA over the week, so it's the real refs. Mm. Thank God. No, that's good. Good. Should be. It's a disrespect and disgrace to the team player. At least the scabs didn't screw us over. When you go to the court, you don't want the worst lawyer. I mean, shit. I mean, well, that's just a public defender. No. My point is, that's what they gave them. Yeah. They didn't get their best. They're stars. They need good refs. At least to try to 
Colorado. And here we go. Colorado LAFC game went earlier, earlier went off the rails. Yeah, that was a good game. Armis actually beat LAFC. I can't believe it. That's his second win of the season. Mm. The same amount of wins he had with Toronto over, like, what, 12 games? All right, come on now. It looks a little... Is That's a probably little the smoke. Or, or That's probably smoke, the smoke, yeah. Think? Okay, yeah. just look. <laughs> Dampy, I didn't know if it was wet or what. No, nah, it's probably just smoke they let off. And here we go. Kansas City kick off. Don't kick that shit back all night. I don't think we've really had to worry about that since Herdman came in. Well, we're going to see. And here we go. Oh, he just got trucked. <laughs> he's already down. I think he got like... trucked. Also. Kaweo plays it forward to Oso. Jaquil. Good, 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 good. Oh, come on, Bernadeschi. What are we? Only one last game today? Yeah, because it's the only game. By the way, hopefully you all had a good, great good Friday. Happy early Easter. Since I won't see you on camera tomorrow. Happy Easter. Enjoy the time with your families. And... Hopefully have a good holiday. Miami. They're playing at the same time. How would I? I'm in the living room. How would I be live for that game? I don't have double screens. Don't worry. I'll be on for Miami over the midweek when they're in Champions League. Get them. Come on. That was dumb. Go. Oh, go. Man. Good job, Longstaff. Come on. Come on, Longstaff. stupid. Come on, Maddie. Here goes one of two. Oh, no, Lord. Don't what are we now, doing, Long? We Gavron. Good. Kaweo. We really could have made them pay there. I don't know why he did not kick that out. Wusu. He got lucky. And it's your ball. No. It's, no. it's a Kansas City throw. Uh, uh, I, don't, I don't agree with that. I don't agree with no, that. I don't either. Nil, nil. I must can't see. We're the ones wearing glasses. Turns out pro is just as bad as they used to be. It's just the scabs were worse. Right. Oh, I never said they were great. They're just better than that. <laughs> True. So if I was a coach, I'd still get fined every week complaining about pro. I was making enough. I sure would. Especially, I mean, you know, it's true. Yeah, but you can't do that because... Nobody gives a shit. If you're making enough, it don't matter. No, but the rules are you can't... You can't I go away against the officials. in every sport like that. You're not supposed to do that. That's just an unwritten rule. When it wasn't a rule. Thank you. <clears throat> not smart either, especially when they referee your shit again. <laughs> Yeah, but they always screw us over. So, <laughs> cross in. Maybe I will miss the scabs because they didn't screw us over. The plan is is to be good enough right. to where when now they screw you, you over. Change my prediction, but no, I'm gonna stop. I feel good about it. I feel good about TFC. They've been lucky all year. The balls bounce their way. I think it will keep bouncing their all way. All year, it ain't that long. Six games. Is, I mean, this year, 2024, this season. So far, they've been, been lucky. longer than that without food. I mean, that's not long at all. Six weeks isn't long? No. Oh, okay. <laughs> Actually, couldn't you die if you go six weeks without food? No, you just need water. You you probably need a little a little. Bernadeschi. In two weeks. But water you need almost every day. Or especially by the third day. Bernadeschi. That's our ball. That's got to be. Oh, come on. Really? Kansas City player put it out. It's not our ball. Lord. Lord. 
You know, what? I want, I want scabs back. I thought, he, I, I thought he hit it and then knocked it out himself. I missed something, and I'm not going to rewind it because it's live, but that's... Davis totally... throws in. Jeez. Predictions for all CCL matches on Tuesday and Wednesday. So, for me, I got Amedica over the Rev because the Revs suck. I got Miami over Monterey because they're playing in Miami. Probably 1-0. Miami can play well at home. It's on the road. I mean, and Messi will be back. Miami. Five. Okay. That's what I bet. I bet I, they're going to win because they have five letters in their name. That's what you're saying. Just because they're there. Well, they're good at home. They're bad oh, on the road. That's my point. I got you. And Messi will probably be playing, even though he's not playing tonight. They're trying to keep him healthy for the Champs Cup game. I don't think he's that hurt. So screw his team during the season. That's Champions Cup means more anyway. I know, but that's what I don't like about some of that is it's too much overlap, and somebody should be able to give a hundred percent to each because that's where he's getting his money. I mean, it's sort of strange to me, you know. But here's, let me finish this, and I'll get back to my point. I think Tigres. I think the crew will beat Tigres, and I think it's Pachuca, Heredia, Pachuca beating Herediano, of course. There's no way Herediano beats Pachuca, right? After them beating Philly 6 0, there's no way. Come on, come on. Come on. Oh. Playing forward. If Messi misses a Champions Cup game, I will eat my hat. He's not missing Did the first leg. you answer that person's question? I answered. Because I didn't mean to mess I it answered. Up. I answered. But back to my point, if I was the manager at TFC, the, the, the tournaments I'd care the most about are Champions Cup and Voyager's Cup. Voyager's Cup because it's the easiest way to get into Champions Cup. And Champions Cup because, well, that's the biggest trophy and, well, we should already have one in our lo in our locker. But we don't. So we need uh, to make that right. My point is all this shit's going on and you still have a season that you're playing, which takes all that takes away, if I'm not wrong, from other. It's hard to manage that. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, there's a lot of uh, fixture congestion. But, yes. Yes. And it's just tough. And I, Which is and why I, they left the Open Cup, which I or they oh, tried oh. to have most of the teams pull out of the Open Cup. The U.S. sides. How about the two girls, one cup? I don't know. I'm just saying that's a lot of moving parts for a manager to even. I mean, I now I sort of respect what they got to go through because other sports don't. No, it's just the season and playoffs. No, in football you have like five competitions throughout the season. No, my point though, it's not different sections. It's not. You got to sit this guy. He can't yeah. play in your best regular game because of something else. Do you get what yeah. I'm saying? Oh, no. Cool. Oh, good, Gavron. Oh, shit. Oh, good block, oh, Rosted. Oh, man. Awesome. Of course. I can't believe Rosted actually did something good for once. Huh. Good. Gavron with a good save, and then Rostid just Look blocked the damn it. thing. Awesome. Ugh. I put him in as goaltender, goalkeeper. Gavron's good, though. For both legs, yes. What's the politically correct term? Keeper or goalie? It's goalkeeper. You goal can say keeper. all three. All three. I don't think there's a bad term for goalkeeper. <laughs> I get what you were doing, but... No, I'm like... Shot! Oh, oh, what a save, Gavron. What a save, Luca. Luca. I don't think Johnson would have made that save, though. Mm -mm -mm. I don't think so, so. I'm sort of scared about my prediction, though. I am, too. Toronto's played some great defense. What's got me scared is they've had to play defense. That's what scares me. Yeah, but at least they're playing defense, unlike they're last right, year. But you can't keep doing this. Somebody's going to mess up. You got to get the back. Come down on, here. Oso. Come on. Oh, go, 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 go. go. Bernadeschi, come on. 
Come on, Fetty. Come on. Come on. Awusu. Oh! Say long staff. No. No. Maddie. Hey, that was Damn. awesome, though. Damn it. You were in the Premier League. Why do you do that, man? I could see it going, and it just went over. Ooh. Longstaff, you were in the Premier League, man. You shouldn't be missing that. I've never seen this from Toronto. They took it down, went all the way, and almost scored without kicking it back. This is what I'm talking about. This is exactly how I'd want them to play. Like, Herdman is exactly playing the way I'd, oh, I'd probably. Oh, man. There's a couple of tweaks I I'm would do. I'm proud of that play. That's that was a awesome. good play. There's a couple of tweaks I would do, especially going into a new full season. But Herdman is very close to how I'd, I'd have them playing, I think. Very close. Man, so. they went from one end to the other. And tried to score, and it was a good play. Go, go, go. Good, 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 good. Go, 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 go. Awusu. Got to get there a bit quicker, man. Got to get there a bit quicker. Come on. I think he touched. I think that was a handball on Kansas City, but okay. I'm, I'm sure. But as I said, this is it. There's a couple of things I would tweak. But the way Herdman has Toronto playing is pretty much how I'd have him playing. So I'm I'm happy with it that it's working. Well, yeah. Herdman needs to hear you. So he can, you know, heard you and hear you, right? Yeah. Get it? Come so, on, Oso. Go, go. He should just listen to you then. I mean, or no, we already have the same mind either way. I know. I mean, he signed Davey Flores. I, I said back in 2020, Davey Flores would be great in MLS, which when I say somebody would be great in MLS, I think you know exactly what that means. Mm -hmm. They should play for Toronto, and they have Davey Flores. I was right. Oh, by the way, he's the best midfielder in the league. Turns out I was right. Mm. All right. I'm just no, – go, no, go, I'm go. I'm talking about – it's now we're back down. Come on, let's Long. Keep, I know that that had to happen to reset, but let's go. Go. Spicer, come on, Tyrese. Mm. Damn. He's a really good number one draft pick on basic cable here in Toronto. They're showing hockey. No surprise. Well, it is hockey night in Canada. And besides, it's on Apple anyway. And even then, this would be on TSN if it was on cable, so. Seven goals each of the last three regular seasons for Daniel Shallowy. One of four players in the league to do that. It's pretty good. Corner for TFC. Good, 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 good. Oh, so nice. Oh, that's... Go, go, go. Play it forward. Play it forward. Long. Kevin Long. Good. Coelho. Long staff. Good, 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 good. Good. Chipped. Nice. Headed back. Spicer. Tyree Spicer. Spicer. <laughs> Man. Keep playing like that. Keep. Keep it going. Man, Spicer is. Ooh. Toronto, like, he wasn't even on the draft. The funny thing is he wasn't even, like, number five on the draft board in the top five prospects, and they picked a number one, and they they made a good pick. That's going to go out for a Toronto corner. 13th minute. Honestly, if I was the manager, that's one thing I'd let the front office do is draft. I'm not Mel Kuyper, but they're good at drafting. Toronto might cook the Eastern Conference. Man, I'd love that if it happened. We're back. 2,024 years ago, Jesus ri risen on Easter, but Toronto's rising now. Cross in, saved by Melia. That was a good one. 
2024 years ago, Jesus rose on Easter. Now Toronto's rising. Yeah, I thought that was clever. 2024 years. Because AD. Yeah. I mean, it's been. Or maybe it's less. I don't know. I don't know. Because AD's after Christ. Yeah, BC is before Christ, but I'm saying. How's it before if he wasn't here? So I think all that's in comfort. I think they got that wrong because something put us here, right? Right. So I guess it was what, 2000? Or a hundred could be two million forty six years ago. I don't what I that means. I'm joking. I don't know. I was I don't making know. it simple. I know, I was joking. That was a good one though. Cross it. Oh my god, Bernadeschi, why are you gonna slip on your ass? Come on, man. Why are you gonna slip on your ass on grass? I get it if it was turf, but dude. Rosted. I don't know why you jumped and kicked that away. Miami two nil RSL. No, Miami's playing NYCFC, though, right? RSL's playing St. Louis. Switch to the Miami game. No. Oh, good, good. Long man. staff, man. If one person would have been there, man. Yeah, that would have been a even goal. Even the water boy could have kicked that in. Bobby Boucher. Or the kicker. <laughs> Knocked a net out from the back. The lonesome Nando's kicker. Nando's flying up, hits people on the second stand. <laughs> Knocks their bear out. Hey, you know. And capture some criminal in the police. <laughs> <laughs> It'd be something stupid. The oh, romance between Herman and Senior might take us far this season. I would hope so, once he's healthy. Suarez scored for Miami. I'm not surprised. Turns out, it's once he starts scoring, he scores. It's just when he isn't scoring. Scores, man. I'm a scores, man. Ronnie, the limo driver, scores, man. <laughs> the month. <laughs> Spicer. Go, 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 go. Good, good, good pressing by Wusu. I like that. Good. Had it. Oh. You think Miami will sign Neymar? Probably. They'll find a way. Even if it breaks the rules, they'll be fine with Miami signing him because it's Miami, don't you know? Oh, look at this. That's, hey, hey, this is pretty good right here. Run that. Yep, Run yep, that yep. Ball. Ah, damn it, Spicer. Dude. Doesn't matter. They're all volleying, boy. Throw it's in. all back and forth. That's awesome. I mean, I'm really I'm only kicked it. back one time that they, sh and then they really got pinned back during to. it. I mean, resetting sometimes is you fine, need to, but I'm just so gun shy. They used to do that reset every play almost. That sucked. Yeah, and then they got burnt by it almost so many times. Damn. It wasn't even funny. I'm like, damn, you don't want to play. Just get out. Good, 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 Jaquiel. Good. That's how for a Toronto throw. Good. I mean, hell, I'm gun shot too when they play it back. Gavron? Dude, just kick the damn ball. Yeah, he should have kicked the shit out of it. I would have kicked the hell out of that. I'd have I think that was. Uh, that scared me. Huh? That scared me, I gotta say. Like, he just, he's like, hey, you know, I'm gonna wait till the striker's shit. right they on just me. just keep flickering back, man, and I, I don't see other teams doing that. I, I'm, I'm, I don't watch other teams, I guess. But when no, you I watch do St. Louis. watch like them, they're not doing that. St. Louis doesn't do it. St. Louis just goes forward. That's what I'm talking about. Unless the other team just. No, roughs up the game like DC did last week. Sometimes it's needed to catch your breath, reset, yeah. whatever. Not when there's seven people down there already. You don't do that shit. Yeah. 
And also, when the keeper's on the ball and then the striker's just running straight at him, he's like, I'm going to wait to the last possible yeah, millisecond I know, I know. to kick this away. And yeah, I'm just going to kick it to the top of the box let me see if to my can, center defensive like mid. You're drawing before someone else draws. Come on! Shot over the Damn. bar. That was way too – how do you hit it that high? I think he was trying to go over top corner, and he just popped it over. Too much power. Yeah, well, quit leg lifting, dude, because you need to – Damn, you – that was – wow. I mean, that – I think Ryan, that might also have been a deflection, too, uh, to give him – that may have been a deflection. maybe a cleat got it? Yeah, I think so, too. I think he was going it top might, corner. I think a deflection got it. it. Maybe too much power. Horrible. I think a cleat – I think Davis's cleat got it, but that's just me. Her cleat might have got it. I don't know. So, never mind. So – Oh, Lord. Gavron, I think he's a good goalkeeper, but dude just short passes it way too much outside of the box. Why would he do that? Like? With all them down there, why would he do that? I don't know. Like, I mean, good he can play with his feet, but here's the problem. If you're playing it to your center defensive mid at the top of the box and that ball gets intercepted, that's going in the back of your net right. two seconds later. Probably. That scares me. <laughs> Cross in, oh, header, Spicer! Oh, oh, man! No. 99. Who is 99? Prince Awusu. If he just would have saw it coming and, and front kicked it. <laughs> or just headed it. But Tyree Spicer, that's a good play. I told you Tyree Spicer was a good player. I told you he's a live wire. Dude, this could have been two to three, seriously. It's been, it's been, it's all right. Oh, man, if not, man, 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 man. I, hey, at least he did better than Io did. Oh, he could have hit a own, own goal. Though. Yeah, that could have. That would have been crazy, wouldn't But it? again. Would that would have counted? That would have counted, yeah, because it was onside. Well, off, if it's own goal, goes off of the defender, it's still onside. Man. So, I mean, if you're forcing an own goal, but – but again, look at Tyree Spicer. He's such a live wire, though. Like, I'm so impressed. Like, he's played well all the minutes he's been on for the past three weeks. I, and he was a number one pick at the Super Draft. But here's the funny thing about Spicer. He wasn't even on the top five prospects board for the Super Draft. Toronto reaches for him, and he turns out to be this good of a player. Hmm. Well, they did something right. Well, he yeah. normally drafts well, but, you know. Well, then they don't keep him. Well, if they keep him, that'd be good. <laughs> yeah. Don't let them go, but they want that money or them picks or whatever they do. Now, the worst part is, is like the young players that they keep aren't the good ones. <laughs> That's the problem. <laughs> I'm just glad they kept Coelho and picked up Spicer. Hopefully they stay here for a while. Even though I think Coelho could play for Spain, but that's just my opinion. Okay, we're just kicking it around. Oh, so it. good, good. Just run the clock. Nil, nil, still. Toronto should be winning this game right now, to be completely frank. Well, it could be one to one fairly easy, but it could be two to one fairly easy. So yeah, you're, you're good. Right. Long staff, be. good, 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 good. Coelho, good. Oh, so. Come on, Osorio. Good, 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 good. Osorio still blocks away, and he didn't. Okay. All right. You could finish your run and get that ball back, but okay. <laughs> hmm. 23rd minute. Whoop. Whoop. I guess he was giving them a breather because yeah, there was a few was openings. So. But nobody was so. pressing, though, so it's well, not as bad as Well, they started coming up. But it's not as bad as some of the others he's pulled tonight. Now, Sean wouldn't do that. He would just kick the damn thing. Maybe that's why Sean's the starter when he's healthy. Like, I, 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 I would want Gavron to kick that damn ball. Like, if somebody's pressing you, 
One, don't kick it at the last millisecond. Second of all, don't kick it to your freaking center defensive mid. Kick that good damn one, ball. Good one, good, good one. Just get it down there. If it's down there, you're good to go. Probably be better if you add players down there to get the second ball, but no, okay. No, but run the clock. I'm just saying. No good, scores, good, good, no good, 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 good. Go, 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 go. Header. Win the second ball. Win the second ball. Good. Coelho. Good. Rolstead, good. Ah, crap. No, no. Get get back there, Spicer. Get back there. Get back there. Get back. He did? Wow. He's pretty cool. I mean, he's he's playing. We're doing good, Connor. How we doing? Or how you doing? Oh, come Play on. Fifth. Go, go, on, go, go. Get on him. Go. That's when you got to... That's what you got to press. You're, you're good. Down. No you're foul, down. damn it. No foul. Good, good, good. Play it long step. Damn it, man. What? He's down. They're, uh, they're stopping no. for injury. Libel down hurt. Yeah. I don't think that was a foul, though, but that'll definitely be a drop ball. Shall we? That's not a foul. Well, I don't know what they're going to call it because I don't know. I'm just saying you could get him on bar with double jeopardy. He, I mean, he, I, don't, I, I don't think so. I think that's entanglement. Like, yeah. at the same time, no ill will, but it still stopped the game. It still slowed it down. It's still extra time. But Leibold's up, so he's, he's up pretty quickly. And then they, they were looking at trying to score. So if it's not a penalty, y'all can fall down. I'm just going to score on my own. That's what I don't like about that. Orlando City's finished. Because what did he do? Make it seem like it hurt worse than it did? Yeah, and then he got up as soon as the game was stopped. Exactly. That's what I just said. Because they could pull the play back, like as you saw. They could pull the play back, which is why I was saying, hey, Longstaff, play that damn ball as quick as you can. Make sure you're out of the realm because if you're in like that area of a player mm -hmm. who's down, they can pull the play back. I was like, play the damn ball forward so they can't call it. Like, you got to play quicker than that. Yeah, because it was in the vicinity. Yeah. If he would have went farther yeah. out, it would have been okay. Went up, I don't know why been... he didn't do that and why he don't know that. He was in the Premier League. He should know that. Because he's been playing this shit since he was – yeah, but Six months he old. was in the Premier League. He played for Newcastle. He was in the English Premier League. Well, he should know to play that ball up as soon as it was at his feet. And uh, he had some open options, too. Uh, so I'm not, yeah. I'm not happy with it. Like, there was open options, like three people ahead open on side, and you're just going to, all right, 27th minute. I don't like it. Because to me, you know damn well if a player's down, they can pull it back if you're in the general right. vicinity. Mm -hmm. There was three guys ahead of you. If you play that ball quickly, they can't blow the whistle. Right. And if you score up a man, well, so damn be it. Right. If they complain, that's on you, Vermees, if you want to cry like a bitch about it, that they didn't stop the game. You can cry. I, I don't care. They didn't stop it. Because, you know, some managers will be like, oh, they should have stopped the game. Our player was down. Forgetting the fact that we would have played the ball forward very quickly. Corner. Cross. Header. Saved by Melia. But there's, there's a lot of managers that are like, they should respect the fact our player might have been down hurt. Well, he wasn't hurt. Okay. I didn't. I would have sent two back for that. Good, go, go, go. Oh, so, oh, so, oh, so. Good. Coelho. Longstaff. Coelho. Rostead. What? And Rostead's just going to run back. Tuck tail between his legs. Then again, I don't want him to do anything too crazy because he sucks. Normally. Okay, yeah, let, yeah just go yeah, ahead. I won't even give it to him. Okay. I only want him touching the ball when he has to. 
he shouldn't even be playing, but 29th minute. But O'Neal. Look, I like that. He's coming up. Look, 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 look. Good, Owusu. Look. Good. That's I it. like just that energy, energy, man. Press him. That's how you make them make mistakes. Yep. I agree. He, oh, if he would have had another helper, that would that would have been, been yeah for sure. I think that would have been something. Spicer, you could have kept running. You could have kept running, but okay, good. See, there you go. Another, another ball comes from the press. They win it back. Spicer. Good, 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 go. Damn it, Oso. You could have ran for that one. That was flat. He got caught flat-footed. He got caught flat-footed. Yeah. So, yeah. you know, whatever. Picked up some apple fritter donuts when I got off work from the bakery. Those things are really good. Deadly good. Okay, that actually sounds that actually sounds nice. Personally, my favorite donuts are just fra uh, glazed donuts. Regular old glazed donuts. Or Timbits. Duh. Nil nil, 31st minute. Spicer heads it. Oso. Ooh. Go, 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 go. Good, good, good. That's out for a throw. Toronto throw. Perfect attack midfield. Leon Fernandez, we need a midfielder. I mean, Julian Fernandez is a good player, but you do need more of a number eight, so to speak. But you would think, I mean, Keaton's more of a six. I would say you need a number eight, New York, but that's just my opinion. Ford, go, 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 go. Spicer, cross, shot, and it's going to go out for a corner. Awusu. Good cross by Spicer, but Awusu just couldn't turn it home. Oh, yeah, because Columbus does have Tim Hortons. That's actually where I got Tim Bits, yeah. Basically, defender just slides in the way. 32nd minute. Front office step up, I agree. But again, y'all need a number eight, I think New York does, to be totally honest. But that's just my opinion. Just my opinion. Nil-nil. Long ball. Our number eight is Max Morales. Unfortunately, I don't know when his injury to be back. I know I'm just saying like back when you I was just saying I know there's a Tim Hortons there. That's all I was saying. Well, you're saying there are Tim Hortons in North Carolina? Well, if I chase hurricanes, go to the Outer Banks. I know where I'm going. I know where I'm going. 33rd minute. Play the ball forward. Rosero. Kansas City. Bernadeschi, man. Toronto throw. Let's go. Okay, good, 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 good. Good, good, good. Good throw. Coelho. Coelho on the ball. Rosted. Nice, nice stretch pass. I like it. I like it. Coelho keeps the ball up and giving away. Good defensive play there by Agata to lead to it. O'Neal. Shane O'Neal. Shane O'Neal cross in, headed away. Good. Good. Davis. Davis. Eric Tommy. Good play by Spicer to defend. Good. Bernadeschi. Good. Go, go, go. Break, 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 break. Go. 
Good, 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 good. Bernadeschi, still Bernadeschi, still Bernadeschi. Chips over. Long staff. Lovely. Let's go. Up. Good. Horrible pass. 34th minute. NYC equalizes. Well, good for them. That'd be good for us. Be good for us. Nil-nil, 35th minute, Alonzo Martinez scores for NYC. Good for him. Good for him. Well deserved first MLS goal. 70% possession to 30% possession. Play the ball forward. Let's go. That goes back. Goes back. Rosero, Melia, Melia, Tim Melia still. Tim Melia, Wusu pressing. I think he waited a bit too long to trigger that press, but... Okay, how we doing, Malha? A little bit too long to trigger the press, but okay. I, I want... Ooh, get in behind. Shot. Save! Corner Kansas City. Who's going to win? I say Toronto. I still think Toronto's played better. Even if it's nil-nil, I think they've played better. But Gavron gets a save there. Just, just a touch too open, but Gavron does get the save. O'Neal almost got burnt. Mm, mm, mm. Just, a, just a touch. See, the thing about TFC that I definitely would change other than what Herdman's doing is I would want TFC's reaction time just to get a bit quicker, like on both ends. I think they're a little bit, still a bit too lackadaisical, I think. Like they don't just go after the ball. I think they want to see exactly like they don't trigger their pet presses quick enough. Well, they're not. That was lucky. He, he's he's lucky. That should have went in. It should be one nothing. Does Toronto play good without Insigne? Sure. Yeah, I think so. I think they're playing good without him this year. Saved. Oh, what a save by Gavron Coelho. Get it out. Get it out, Coelho. Good, 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 good. Go, 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 go. Drops to Eric Tommy, but at least it got cleared. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, at least it got cleared. I mean, yeah, the curse is over, but Toronto could still get better. That's my point. Like, the bad days are over, but we could still get better. I think there are still things they can improve on. I'm not mad with her, but this I think there's what things. I'm talking there. about. He should have just kicked the shit out of it. Long staff plays it up to Long, Coelho. But again, I, I really think their reaction time needs to get a bit quicker, even still. On triggering the press on the second ball, I still think it needs to get quicker, personally. I think you need to be blood, you just basically need bloodhounds. You three more quicker. You don't even need everybody quicker. Especially in the midfield. But for me, like I want them to be bloodhounds for the ball. Once the ball's in their vicinity, go for it. If it's a little bit... If it's a little bit of a dangerous play, so be it. But you got to go for that ball. If it's in the vicinity, it's in the air above you, you got to go oh, for it. Oh, so! Oh, so! Yes! Yeah! Goal, Jonathan Osorio! I hope, so. I hope so. I think it's offside. Nope, it's offside. Let's check it. Come on now. I think that's BS. TFC offside. I think they're going to walk away with a win today. They should be ahead right now. I think that's harsh. He wasn't offside. Now I need to see. I need to see the VAR call. Dude was on. Hold on. Stay on. Owusu's on. Oso. He's, nope, he's off. He is off. Yeah. I mean, he's a body off. He's, yeah, he's. Yeah, he actually was off. Shit. Here we go. Hmm. That's still. That, I don't like that. Really. Yeah, really? but with the new offside rule that Wenger's been 
Arson Wenger's been proposing, he would have been on. Well, you should, because it makes it more interesting. And if somebody gets that deep, that's your fault. It exactly. Ain't, it ain't because somebody stepped one step too far. That's bullshit. Yeah. That's like telling a receiver, you can't run 100%. You, you, yeah, you know exactly. what I'm saying? Oh, you got to go 90s to let somebody try to intercept it from you. I mean, that's not, it should be passing like that. Yeah, exactly. Right? Yeah, I think so, but I don't want to change their game. I mean, Wenger's trying to, that just, the former Arsenal manager. That seems really crappy. But, yeah, I mean, it was a good play. Yeah, it just, was. Oh, but, okay, that's a free kick for Kansas City offside. Go to Wusu. See, that's what I'm talking about. Press as soon as you get there, Wusu. Don't wait two seconds to see. Okay, well, I didn't know that they wouldn't do it, but there could have been, it could be 2 nothing, 2-1, two, 2-2 two, two right now. You know that, yeah. right? I still think Toronto should be leading right now, to be totally honest. Yeah. Oh, Lord, Jesus. What are you doing, Lon? I know. I don't, why would you kick that out? Just get it out of here. Kaleo. That's called parking the bus. Kick it out and let them reset down here. That's what you do. Yeah. Oof. Oof, my own. Yeah, Aaron Tommy. When you leave it. Oof, my own. Oof, my own. Agata. Agata. Oh, off the oh. post. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. That is lucky. Fuck That's a free kick. They out. almost did. Yeah. Agata puts it off the post. Oh, he should cover his face because that man, that was bad. He should. Yes. Like you should. That should have went in. Like I know that was like three oh, men man, ahead of him, was but perfect. that was a corner. good shot too. I, I mean, oh, I, wait, crossbar. It was. It was yeah, no, he hit both bars that look like, Yeah, I right? think he hit it where it connects. Like, perfect. If he just dropped that an inch lower, that's a goal. Ooh, perfect. No goal tender. Goal He's going to save that, no. Goalie, whatever you want to call them. Don't, Nobody's going to save that. It. Not unless you're Shaq. Well, he can't. Well, I've never seen Shaq jump that high. Shit. Shaq is with his hands. He that motherfucker is about eight foot tall with his hands spread out. If he just leaps, if he just does his toes, he's up to nine feet. What is that? Ten? I would say so. Yeah. And he used to. He, he can dunk. He could get up. Yeah, but he couldn't <laughs> hit a free throw to save his life. No, he couldn't. But he made more money than we got doing that shit. That's awesome. And he always got pissed off that he was never the star. He was always number two. Yeah. Like, he was never Kobe or never, never Penny or no, never cause I, no. Steve Nash. <laughs> it's just like a center in football. They don't get no recognition at all, right? Right. But they're there every night. Unless you have a podcast like Jason Kelsey. And only because Travis is probably on that podcast, too, does he get any recognition. I mean, it's probably it's probably true. The only reason Jason Kelsey is really known and favorited is because his brother's Travis Kelsey. Oh yeah, no, I didn't mean I didn't even mean them. No, I don't thought... even want to talk about them two idiots. I'm saying, just a sinner does stuff every day, and he didn't get. I mean, like Shaq, he was when you have a three point player and some big. Yeah. Hoopla, slams, and passes, it takes away yeah. from what you're doing automatically. Right. You knew that going into the spot, right? Right. Free kick, collect, or also, oh, good, 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 good. Yeah, a little bit too short of a pass. Too short. Oof. They, they got this. this. Come on, Gavron! Oh, get, get what back, a get save! Back, get back, get what back. a save, Gavron! That and Kawhi takes it forward. You, I've never seen this. That was that awesome. was awesome, dude. 
It Y'all shouldn't wrong, have man. happened, though. This is what scares me. Why did that happen? Free kick. It's not that Toronto. he played good. It's how did you let that happen to that man? Well, at least he came off his line. Forget what he did. You should have never put him in, in that, that position. Spot. Fair enough. And if he wouldn't have made it, you couldn't be mad. Let me at see. Him. Was it? It was Rostad. Of course it was. Of course he was the one that got burnt. Of course. Obvious now. Okay. It was Rostad well, who I'm got just burnt. Saying, you should say I'm never. <laughs> I don't know why Mama Guy hadn't been played either. Header. I'm, I'm surprised. They barely played him at all this year. And I thought he was our best center back last year. See, that that's where me and Herdman diverge. I'd be playing Mabuka every week. Or at least every time I could play him. That's got to be a free kick the other way. That's got to be a free kick the other way. Get on him! Go! Now that's what I like. Get on him. Stop. Yes. Go, 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 go. Have some energy. Take some Gatorade. Shit. Get on him. And we're going to go straight two minutes, actually. Some stoppage time. Nil, nil. TFC gets well, to restart the play. Oh, I said two. I saw two in something. See? Yeah, Plus two. Two, two yep. nothing. See, I, I saw that. You count. did see no, some. I'm joking. No, I'm joking. Oh, so good, 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 good. Ah, Jesus, man. Almost, almost got that there. But again, Luca Galvron's been spectacular tonight, though. I thought he's been great. Again, he probably shouldn't have been in that position, but at least he came off his line and saved the ball. I swear to God, if that, that's a free kick, really. I still think it's 2 1 Toronto tonight. That's what I think. I still, I still, still I don't think that's a free kick, but okay. Eric Tommy went down on his own ass. You think? Ah, uh, no. No, that's... And they no. didn't call the other one. That's this not is, a free kick for me. I'm, no. This is, what I'm, this is no. what I'm getting at. No. And now our best center back's injured. We, we can't catch a break. We'll be all right. Get up. Get up. Now Kevin Long's hurt. We just can't catch a break, can we? Why? Well, at least that means if Kevin Long comes off at the half, that means Mabuka has to play, which I guess is good. I don't know what, seriously, I don't know what Malula and Mabuka did for Herdman not to play him. I really don't. So they'll add another minute. At Probably, least, right? yeah. I would think at least a minute. <sighs> He's got to be legit hurt. Nah, he'll be all right. You can get up. Get your ass up. <laughs> I bet you hear hut 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 hut. You get your ass up. <laughs> and, this <laughs> and this is why MLS. And this is why MLS should do what MLS Next Pro does. If you're down he'll on the ground right. getting checked, he'll you can't be, be on right. the pitch for three minutes. He'll be all right. Instead of just coming straight back on. How long will you be out? <laughs> <laughs> oh, let's see. I know. A one, a two, a three. I can know you'll be out three minutes. <laughs> Get it? I can. Never mind. Not no. right? Not close enough? No. Oh. All right. Mr. Owl, how many licks does it take to get the Tootsie Roll center of a Tootsie Pop? Three Let's see, seconds. I know. One, One a two, two hut, a hut, three. Hut, 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 hut. Drop three. <laughs> you got two concussions from getting picked up. <laughs> 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 boom, boom. Yep. I got one from getting hit, one from being dropped, one from being dropped. That's three. Forty eighth minute. Tim Melia. And if your referee ever brings a igloo light cooler out, you better tell him to get away from you because he's gonna drop your ass somewhere. 
You remember that little code? Yeah, I right remember. Now? Yep. And it's halftime. Oh, nil, nil at the half. Had a minute. Nope. Turns. No. Why well, can't? Could they have done they that? They could have if they wanted to. Wow. Mm. I'll, I'll take it, though. I think Toronto's playing forward very well. If they hold on to the ball, they're going to win. They'll find a goal. They haven't. They've got four clean sheets. Hold on. Yeah, four out of well, four and a half because they're six game. They've given out five, four washer dryer pairs, and they're about to give out a fifth. If that's still happening, I don't know because the GE logo is not on here anymore. Maybe they don't do that anymore. But needy people are getting washer dryer pairs. They're still doing that. High level ones too. Gee, make some good washer dryers. Well, that being said, we'll take a short break at the half. Talk about the stats. Get this one going. Nil nil at the half. At least it's a draw, but we should be winning. I think Toronto's been playing well. Sit tight, I'll be back.
All right, we're back to the stats of the half. We got six shots to eight, one shot on goal to six. 64% possession and 36% possession, 338 passes to 190, 86% pass accuracy to 71%, three fouls to five, two offside to one, zero yellow cards to one, zero red cards to zero, five corners to three. I think Toronto should be leading in this half. They've played the ball four. They've held good possession. They've defended very well. They look like the better team so far, I think. They should be leading. They should be winning this game so far. But Toronto needs to play, hold the ball forward, play it, play a little bit quicker. But other than that, I think Toronto's the better team. I think Kansas City are playing very tough, but I still think Toronto are the team on the front foot for most of this game. But we shall see how the second half goes. Can Toronto stay on the front foot? Can they get a bit faster? Can they put a goal away? Gavron's played amazingly. Even if we win 1-0, that definitely could be a uh, man-of-the-match performance. So, we shall see. But the second half's about to start momentarily. Eight thirty, St. Louis for Salt Lake. I can't watch that whole one. Mm. And then Atlanta versus Chicago on Easter Sunday, two forty-five p.m. Which I'll just be watching because why not watch a game on Easter Sunday? I did last year, League at Mackey's, but I did just watching. I think it was Atletico versus Pumas. Toronto's gotten close. Now, which club is older? 96 was Kansas City. Yeah, Kansas City's older. Oh, are they? Yeah, they were expand they were hmm. inaugural. As the Kansas City Wizards. Now, I think the Sporting Kansas City brand isn't as old as TFC is. No, I, I just meant as a team. As a I team, didn't Kansas mean City. Name. It doesn't, yeah. They were in year one. They've been around the whole time of MLS. They just rebranded. That's awesome. That's cool. That's from Wizards to Sporting. Yeah. Let's. They they didn't wish herself anywhere, did they? Honestly, though, I think I kind of hate that the rebrand because Wizard seems a lot cooler. I like Kansas it. City Wizard oh, that seems a lot cooler. Cool. And you could all have uh, wands and go, go, go. Especially like the '90s colors, they had like all the colors of the rainbow on their kits. Yeah. Oh, did they? Yeah. That would have been cool back then. Wow, that's but then cool. they just went to like blue and white, like in the mid two thousands, and that probably was what spelled the end of that era. Because like wizards just wearing blue and white. No, but if they would have kept the colors, like they would rainbow, be all though. up yeah. in the group. It'd be all good. Which I at least want to see a Kansas City secondary kit that's based off the Wizards colors. Like, they just do it at least like once. A, yeah, bring it back. Let's see. Because, I mean, LA. Hold on. 2006. 26. Is MLS 30. They should do that for 30. 30. And, bring that back. And their away kits are 26. So their next away kit could be Wizards based. That. Look, you're already calling it. Could be. Get ready to buy it. That'd I would. Be awesome. <laughs> like, because their newest away kit I'm was this saying, year. It's coming up. It's coming up. 
I'm just saying MLS 30s 2026. Well, oh wait, they're probably gonna celebrate it 2025 though. Okay, whatever. Same thing. You know what I mean. Bring yeah. it back. Because MLS 25 was celebrated in 2020. I don't know. I'm just saying, bring no, it what, back I'm, at something. Bring it back. I agree. And play a game in their old kit. That'd be cool. Yeah. Who do you think will win tomorrow, Man City or Arsenal? You know, I say Arsenal. I, I was going to say that, too. I want One, I want Man City to lose. Second of all, I just think Arsenal is the better team right now. So... On both counts, Arsenal. Even though it made oh, me Oh, man. That was, man, that was nice, too. He did. You know what? He got lucky yeah. on one, but. And then that was just a good save, even though he should have never been in that position to begin with. Like, I mean, Galvron should have been in that no man's land to begin with. No, he but should he be was. back in the goal. Playing the damn goal. He shouldn't be playing the game. He should be playing the goal. Your goalie should be playing the goal. He shouldn't even have to worry about that shit. And he got lucky. But he's done like three so, great plays. So you're basically saying to me that you think if a keeper comes off his line, that's a last ditch effort. In most no, cases. what I think is if a team is playing a certain defense or offense, the goalie should not be put in that position. He has one job to keep shit from going in. He should not be out past his line out there doing any of that. You protect him. I agree. You don't put him now. If there's two or three of you down there and it gets through, then it gets through. But you should not leave that man hanging out there like that. I agree. You shouldn't want your keeper that far off the line. I agree. No, that's that's my point in this whole thing. That and passing back other than get a breath and reset every now and then. You keep yeah. going, and you never let that man be by himself. Right. You better run your ass down there. And if he's normally off his line that much, it's because you didn't get your ass back there. That, and if he can't stay on his line, then we need to talk to him. If he's making it seem like he's you're... You're doing that right. to him. He's just preemptively coming out. Then we need to have a right. talk. And I don't know that much about soccer, but we would be talking. Right. TFC well, kicks off in the second half. I mean, I agree with that. Like, if your keeper's just coming off his line to come off his line, that's that's hurting you Some as a do team. it. Some do it because they want to just be in the shit, and that's not their job. Their job is to protect that area back there where that white line is right up in there. Now they can come out halfway to that spot. You see that little yeah, white spot? The, the penalty spot, yes. That's okay. 12 yards. But I've seen them out there way too goddamn far. I would I would agree like to me coming off your line, of course there's a goal line and there's a 6 yard box. To me if you're getting past the penalty spot, that's when I got to start asking questions. If you're damn near almost outside of the box making a save, that's when I, mean, I got to start. If you're out there every once in a while, I get yeah. it. You make the decision. But if you're out there all the time, something's wrong. Yeah. You need to get in the game and not be a goaltender. Because uh, in hockey, they don't they come they don't out a little bit, paint. but they're always around that net, right. brother. They don't come out. Their the job paint much. is to be around the net. Right. His job to me is to be around the net. Right. Like a shark. But again, sometimes on corners you have to jump out to the penalty spot to catch the ball. 
which I that's don't mind that. that. That's I'm part talking. of the game. I'm talking about when it's game and you're right. out here. See, people should be down here. They should have one guy. Even in the NFL, they have people picking up the people when they right. kick a field goal. They have two people to block. Right. I personally think the center halves need to stay as close to the box as they need as they can need. I would I would say can. I would say, and that guy needs to be fast. He needs to be like a center fielder that he can play back and right. forth like. In foosball, do you right, get what I'm exactly. saying? There's those lines. But, There's lines to that. And you shouldn't put him in that position. Like wing backs to me, if you've got a back four, are the back are the defenders that could go up the pitch more. Depending right. on the way the play is. Yeah. But the center back should stay as close to the box they can. He should be center, right? Right. Right. That's what they call it. And if you have three center backs, well, those are the three that should stay the closest to the box as they can. Like, yeah, I mean, of course, if you have the ball, they should push up. But as soon as you lose that ball, they should go, they should fall back as quick as they can. Now, don't get me wrong. Somebody kick it long and everybody's yeah. faster and gets down there and he gets double, triple teamed. Yeah. It is what it is. Right. Sometimes it'll happen. Yeah. But. Just like in the old West, some people are quicker on the draw, but for the most part, you know when they're going to draw, right? Exactly. Get back there and get on them. But to me, that's more of a problem but if the center backs push forward way too much. They over, then they're going to trigger that pass over the top. They and you better over, hope that they forwards on side. They overthink all of it. It's overthinking. And everybody wants to score, and everybody wants to be the star, and everybody wants to do yep. good. But not everybody can. Right. And as soon as you find your place, that's when you'll be most productive and uh, can get stuff done. That's fun. Captain says your dad loves talking. Yeah, you see where I get it from, don't you? Do you see where I get it from now? It ain't my mom. I don't think he was being mean. I just thought he was being funny. Oh, yeah. I, I'm sorry if I offended anybody. I, I don't think he did. I, I don't think he did. That. He was no, just saying I didn't he loved talking. To do that. I'm sorry. I just think he, I just think he said he, he I just think he was saying you love talking oh, yeah, and yeah, now I said yeah, yeah. there's a reason where it came from for me. 50th minute. But again, it depends on where your players play is, is my thought. Like if you're going to play your center backs way too high, of course there's going to be a pass over the top and they're going to try to beat you that way. So you can't let them get too high anyway. Plays forward. That's offside anyway. Oh my goodness. Mm. But again, see, that's kind of what I'm talking about, though. I don't know. I, uh, I mean, that was sort of an offside trap, too. I, okay. Uh. But on that first play, though, that got the call, no. I'm going to be watching a lot of football this summer. Leafs Cup, Copa America, Euros. Can't take it. It's going to be fun. Oh, and the Olympics. Don't forget. The Olympics also have. Okay. I, th I think Jaquille could have pulled back a little bit there, but okay. Good throw. Gavron. Coelho. Ooh. That's just that's just bad luck. Could have picked his foot up a little bit more, but that probably still would have went out anyway. 
physics wise, but I'm not the yeah, physics yeah, major here. Yeah. Kansas City throw. See, I mean, I'm not very, I never even took physics, but I think I know even if he picked his foot up and hit the ball, it still probably would have went out. But I didn't take physics. And that's a free kick for Kansas City. Ooh. Nobody did anything. It's probably more because he got squeezed, okay. to be honest. Well, I, mean, I still think that. that's harsh, though, because the ball was got. I didn't see any play. Real Madrid versus Man City, I have to watch that. Well, I think a lot of people will. No, the the eclipse is Monday, yeah. So, no, no worries. No, the eighth. That's Monday, though. No. Not this Monday, next Monday. It's not the first, it's the next one. That's yeah. what I meant, yeah. Okay. It's I, next I, Monday. It's bad. not April Fool's Day, it's next Monday. My bad. April Fool's. Easter and then April Fool's and the next day feels weird. Go out with your glasses on on the first. April Fool's. Well, then you'll get sucked up into a tornado. <laughs> Track it. Watching the storms with the glasses on on April Fool's Day. What? Is this supposed to happen? They said there's going to the be severe Monday weather on Monday. Send down a tornado? Now, yeah. actually, there should be some severe weather in the plains on, on the eclipse day, though, which would uh -huh. totally be funny if... Like, during the eclipse, there was, like, a dark tornado. No, that would be crazy. That would be the that craziest be picture crazy, ever. Man. That would be crazy, man. That'd be, like, the most badass weather picture That's ever. Some bullshit. The most historic one, to be honest. Yeah. The next one's, like, like for 99 years or so. And who's to say there'll be severe weather that day in the plains? Or anywhere, for that matter. I don't think there's ever been a solar eclipse and a tornado at the same time. I I've never heard of that. Oh, come on. I should have. Bernadeschi. Go, Bernadeschi. Go, 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 Berna. Oh, oh. man. He kicked Is that a corner? No, nope, goal kick. No. He kicked it. And he thinks it's a pen. And it hit the damn and he ball. thinks it's a pen. I don't know. I, I need to see that. He thinks he got a call taken away from him. He goes, he goes. He thinks he got taken out by the keeper. He thinks that could be a pen. Uh, you know what? Maybe. Maybe. No ball. Melia oh, got him. That might be a pen. That might be a pen. I I, I think it may be. Wow. Well, I think Bernadeschi's sucks. right. That I think sucks. it's right. That sucks. I think that's a pen. That Montreal sucks. Red Card, Waterman's out. Gio Savarese's on MLS 360 in English right now. They are talking to VAR, though, so that's the good news. But I think that's a pen. Nope, goal kick. That's harsh. I, uh, I think, yeah, pro screwing us again. I want the scabs back. The scabs didn't screw us, which is funny. But the real refs will. Go, 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 go. Ball don't lie. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Get on so, him. Come on. Come sliding in, buddy, and block it with your leg and then pop up. I mean, also just did just come back from a hip injury. I wouldn't I wouldn't try that. Yeah, but. I didn't know who that was. I don't give a shit about that. You play and you play. Good, 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 good over the bar. 56 minute, nil, nil. Besides, I don't think I've... Wait, did Gavron get a yellow card for what? Hold on. What? Nah. Time wasting? What what time did he waste? Oh, Coelho on that tackle on Voltaire. Oh, okay, that's probably what the yellow car was for. Coelho got a yellow. Yeah, that's that was a tackle that deserved it. 
But it's a goal kick because the ball went out before they gave the yellow. Good. Which, I mean, in theory, they could still pull it back. Kansas goal. Ah, hell. Cross in. Headed away by Long. Golasso! Damn. Eric Tommy, I'm guessing. No, it's Remy Voltaire. Of course. What a goal. That's a banger by Remy Voltaire. 1 0 Kansas City. That was a great goal. Long plays it straight to Remy Voltaire, and he just. I mean, we've been winning on Wonder Strike for the past couple of weeks. We were bound to lose to one, probably. That was a good one. That was good. Corner down, and he's all the way. And Gavron's on the wrong side I mean, of the net. Yeah. Right. Even if it was up or down, that he wasn't going to get it. Corner, he was no. on the wrong positioning. Yeah. Watching the game right now, over. did you see Kai Kamara's at LAFC now? Yep, and I'm pissed off. Toronto should have picked up Kai Kamara, but what did they do? They let Kai Kamara train with LAFC and sign with them. Oh, and by the way, guess what? Halfway through the season, LAFC is going to have freaking Olivier Giroud anyway. So Kai Kamara is really only starting half the season for him. So he's fine with that. I can't believe we missed out on that, to be totally honest. Think this game's going to be a draw now? No. Come on, come I still on, think man. we can win. I still think we can win. But we need to score pretty. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, 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 no. Wait. Whoa. Okay. Throw in. Davy Flores coming on for Alonzo Coelho. That's the right call. 1 0 down for Toronto. Yes, Kansas City has the lead. Davy Flores on for Coelho which is the right move because Coelho's on a yellow. Davey Flores could play about a half. Okay. Mm. I don't know why he's only playing a half, but I guess since he played two games for Honduras. No, no, no. This better not be a no, penalty. No, let's not do this. Wow. Well, why wouldn't you get that? At, yes, thank you. Get that out of here. The Galaxy made a comeback against Kansas City last week. I know that, yeah. Welcome back, pro refs. We talk about the Dallas game or something about penalty or something. Oh. Yeah, I miss the scabs. Bernadeschi. It's got to be a Toronto throw. Yep. Monterey versus Guadalajara is about to happen. Pass possible to yellow. Yeah, you're talking about the Dallas game. Davy Flores. These green guys are soft this. as hell. Y'all got this. Y'all got this. Austin, I'm guessing. 60th this. minute. Come on now. Go, 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 go. Davy Flores. Davy Flores. Longstaff. Go, 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 go. Davy Flores. No, they've given them win too. I don't know what they're doing. Long well, and park it back. Yeah. Well, we've got, I think Bernadeschi should add a penalty. I think we've gotten screwed a couple of times in this game. I know we're down, but I think we've gotten screwed a couple of times. So the scabs didn't screw us. That's the one plus about them is they never screwed Toronto. We just got to play games. So pro legit does have a, Legit does have a agenda against us, which I'm not surprised, but it's just the real pro refs have an agenda against us. 
or we're one of the teams that have an agenda against. I guess Dallas is the other because uh, Dallas just got screwed as well. Cross in. Corner for TFC. Offside. Damn. Miami are drawing with New York City at home. No Messi. Suarez, it's 1-1. I think at some point Miami will sack Tata or will they keep him? He's there. He's there for Messi. Probably not, unless Javi comes over. Does TFC fall a little bit in their performances now that Insigne is injured? No. I thought we'd been playing pretty well. I think we just got beat by a wonder goal that we've been winning by for the past couple of weeks. Um, I mean, that was a good goal. That, I mean, that's, that's what I'm saying. Good. Sometimes it happens to you. It doesn't always happen for you. Sometimes it happens to you. But I thought Tyrese Spicer's been playing well. I'm not mad about the performance at all. I think we could still win this game if we just play the damn ball forward. Kansas City's defending well as well. They're a tough team. But I, I think we're playing well. I think we're playing well still, even without Insigne. I think we're playing well. So Toronto's not going to lose at home. I don't. I think they'll at least draw. That'll be good too. I'll, I'll take that. Yeah. I don't think they're losing. Six third minute. SKC two or not Liebold plays it on shallowy Agata not again Golasso and Gavron should have had that one but Jake Davis Jake Davis with the goal a Golasso. Oh, that was good. Yeah. I mean, I got to give it to them. I give it to They're them. They're shooting out far and they can't react. So that's the type of shooting yeah. I want. See, if we stud Jacob Schaffelberg, we could have gotten one of those because he ain't afraid to shoot. Half these guys are afraid to shoot outside of the box for Toronto. Oh, I still think it's been two wonder goals. If we lose this game, it's because of two wonder goals. They're, they're not afraid to shoot. We are. So, I still think we've defended well. We just have gotten caught out twice and got on legitimately. Okay. 2 0 Kansas City. I can't say two wonder goals. Yeah, we're losing. Do I think we deserve, be, deserve to lose to two wonder goals? No. But they weren't afraid to shoot, and they scored twice. What can I say? They need to score two to draw. Yeah, we're not drawing now. I don't think we have time to score two. I think we've lost this game. I think it's over now. Because, you see, we have players that are afraid to shoot from outside the box. And the one player who isn't this year is injured. We, we should have kept Jacob Schaffelberg. You know what? Once soccer was debating it, six weeks till we got positive performances again. Again, I don't think we played badly today. We got beat by two wonder goals. Again. The scoreline does not tell the whole story. It just wasn't our night. Yeah, we're probably, what, fifth now? Still in a playoff place. Can't win them all. You only see reality when there's no hope. I mean, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. As long as I have hope, I have hope. Even if the reality probably doesn't even say it at hope, times where there's just a little bit of hope. You're probably right. But as long as I have hope, I have hope. Urban can't do it. 
I think you can. It's a bad night. Bill Manning still needs to go, yes, but... With the most injuries in the league, the results will reflect. And that only really started happening when Insigne went out, so... DeAndre Kerr's coming on for long staff. Cozy Thompson's coming on as well. But see, that's that's part of the mentality problem. There's no cup for us this season. Didn't say MLS Cup was coming our way. I think Toronto can draw. Uh, nah, I think we're done. Stick a fork in us. I think this game's over. Unless DeAndre Kerr has a banger of 20 minutes, uh, no. Supporter Shield is done. Two losses and it's done? But we still haven't seen you out for five weeks. That's probably your point. But whatever. Oh! Jaquiel! Jaquiel! Oh, and he didn't even shoot. Damn, he had a chance. He didn't even shoot. No, he didn't. I don't Damn. know. He was on side and he didn't even shoot. Good well, tackle by Libel. I mean, he didn't have a chance. Yeah, Libel got in there. He caught up. Libel got in there. Yeah. That's the kind of play I'm talking about. Running. He was running. So it's not his fault. He just he just didn't want it to happen, brother. Yep. He was running, man. Yep. Sixty ninth minute two nil. Yeah, I'd rather have a, I'd rather have a big mouth and deliver on some of my promises than say nothing and deliver on nothing. So that's my defense of Herdman. Yeah, if you have a big mouth, you're probably only going to deliver on some of your promises. But guess what? I'd rather only I'd rather have a big mouth and deliver on some than say nothing and deliver on nothing. That's just my opinion, though. I think Herdman's delivered on a good bit of what he said so far. I don't think he just has a big mouth, but. It is what it is. Now, you could say, but Teddy Roosevelt said, speak softly and carry a big stick. Yeah, here's the problem, though. The last manager we had that spoke softly didn't carry a stick at all. Let me tell you something. I'd rather speak loudly and carry a frickin' sword. That's just my opinion. Speak loudly and carry a sword. You just better not to swing the damn thing. Oh, whoa, Free whoa, kick. Whoa, whoa, Free whoa, kick for TFC. Give them one. Give them one. Hey, we've been screwed over multiple times yeah, tonight. I've, so. I've seen it. I've, at least three or four. I mean, I've, I've seen it. It's been bullshit. Yellow card for Liebold. Here's a free kick for TFC. I mean, you could let people not even know how to call a game called better than that. That's what I don't understand. That's what I don't like about soccer because the refs don't seem to have some consistency. Consistency. They're all willy-nilly bullshit. At least other sports have tries to have some right. kind of systematic calling. Come on. Free kick, Bernadeschi. Blocked into the wall. 
I guess he was trying to go Olympico, and that just didn't pan out. No, it didn't pan out. Save Amelia in the 72nd. I'm calling it no cup or anything else for us this season. I, I see really no hope. Even the most even the most negative people about this team see hope right now with Herdman. You're just a doomer, I guess. I'm not I'm not I'm not holding it against you. You could have your opinion, but they need some I mean they, they do need some shot callers, man. You got to take the shot. Right. You can't be keep passing that shit every two inches and think something's going to happen and see, when you let all of them get down there. And see, there. Bob Bradley still hurt us there because he got rid of Jacob Schaffelberg. Yeah. See, there's been more goaltending on the team than it is the goaltender is what pisses me off. Do you see I agree. Yeah, I, see, I see your point, yeah. There's been more blocks by team than him, and that is not right. And the two shots were long and good. I agree. You can't blame so, that guy either. So you're saying most of Galvron's saves came out because he's been held out to try. Oh, he did good, but... Those two shots, he was at a spot. And yeah, he was, was out of possession. Yeah, I mean, he ain't Spider Man. I mean, it, I don't it think ain't I don't even think Sean would have saved those. To be totally honest, no. I think Gavron had a better shot. It would be to four be to nothing if he was in there. I think because there was a couple of shots that were. I, I don't mean, think it would have came up. There See, could be some luck to that. There's I, luck I don't to think. That. I think Gavron is a little bit more of a sweeper keeper than Sean is, especially now. I don't think Sean would have came off his line when he when Gavron was left out to dry, he was like, screw it, I gotta do this myself. And he came off the line and saved it. Right. I don't think I think Sean would have just got beat. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. So so there's some good and bad there. Yeah. One needs to learn from the other and be one or the other. That's it. Right. But the way we're playing, we need to keep it. Nothing. But the way. And it was a good game. But the that's way we play. That sucked. That, that sucked. But the way we play, we should have a keeper that's a sweeper keeper like Gavron. Because the way we play, we might have a position where he might just be hung out to dry. And I'm not saying that's oh, it will plans. Be, but it but if it happens. Be two to nothing. This was a good game. Even if Kansas City won, it should be 4-2, 3-2. Yeah, in theory, it should be a 2-2 draw, but it isn't. That's what I'm saying. That's the problem. So they're not. I mean, they got to learn from this. If they don't, you got a long season to go, is all I'm telling you. You got a long season Yeah, they got to go. learn. They're doing this shit again. I agree. They got to learn. Even though they're a little more fast forward, they need to be faster forward. I agree. And protect their goaltender. I agree. Which is honestly the things I would slightly. Those are the two things. We're Those are the two things I would Monday. change. Those are the two. That's the two things, things I think Herdman's forgot. Monday. Because you can go home Sunday and lick your wounds. Come and celebrate Monday, Easter. We're Monday, playing. we're talking. We're talking. It's on. Because I'm not going to be out of here. You're going to be out of here. If I was the manager, that's how I would be talking. Right. Well, I agree with you. There's a reason why you'd be my assistant. And hell, I probably have, after this, I'd probably, I mean, I'd chew them out too, but I definitely have you maybe oh, start man. the. There's no. There's no forgiveness in that. Wait, eh, don't start that shit either. Oh, come on. 
No, nah, it's too late for that. No, nope, no. Nope. You should have done that shit back in 50 minutes. No, nope. starting fights now because you're down is not. No. Nope. I don't like that either. I don't like cool. that either. Now, if you're ahead and you're showing some fire because they're starting to nip at your heels, I think it's a little bit better. But if you're down and you're starting fights at 2-0 and you probably ain't coming back, if it was what are you one, doing? I, I get it. understand But that, like but this? They've no. already smoked no. your ass. No. You can't no. talk shit when you're a loser. Do you exactly. understand? Exactly. And all that crap doesn't mean anything. But, like, the two things that I would change is exactly what we're talking about. We need to protect the goalkeeper more, even if he's a sweeper-keeper. And we need to be faster to the ball. I don't care what he's doing. No, I'm just saying. I know. Even if he does. I don't care if he's a sleeper-keeper. If he brings a pillow in and just lays down, protect your goalie. And we need to be faster to the ball on both ends. That's the two oh, things yeah. I think Herman's it, forgot. It is a little. We need to be faster to the ball at both ends. It's a little slow. They are slow. I've seen a lot of teams way faster than Toronto. It's like they don't know what to do after the fourth kick. You're like, what are you doing? What are you thinking about? You grew up doing this shit. You grew up doing it. You had a ball in your hand before you had a bottle. Do that shit. Good, go, go, go. But even then, like, even when I mean faster, it's not just playing faster, but even on the press. We do not trigger the press quick enough. We it's, don't go after the second ball quick enough. It's not being done now. Look. They're letting them all reset. Go. Cross. Shot! And of course. And we're way behind all. the ball. And when you're behind, when you can't shoot worth a shit. In the first game, Prince started to press forward. It's a free throw I agree. from Shaq. We know it ain't going Yeah, in. but again, again. The cross was good by Spicer, but again, they waited. They didn't go off but as soon as that ball no, hit his foot. They, they just they stood back. They stood the back. And kick. No, they, they need to go. As soon as that back. ball hits the foot, they need to go. Finish that run. Don't don't just stand there two inches away. Somebody could have turned that home. If they just finished the right. run. Why right. not finish the run? Right. I don't know. And that's the second time that's happened tonight. I don't know why they're not doing it. It's the second time that's happened it's tonight. Like they just accept losing. Yeah, that's the thing I don't like. Like, I thought Herdman was better than that. It's okay. Hey, we only lost two to nothing. It wasn't five to nothing. What? Yeah, it's better than last year, but you still don't have three what? points from this game when you should have at least got one. Fuck if you lose one to nothing, you lost. To me, here's what I would say. I'd be like, we still, yeah, we didn't lose five like we did last year, but here's the thing. We still didn't pick up a point. We should have at least picked up a point last night with the way we play. You let them smoke us and see – what they did is what you should be doing. Why do you not have the balls to shoot? I don't know. I'm, like y'all are afraid I'm, to shoot. I'm still wondering all that. Like, why are you afraid to just shoot from deep when you have the chance to do it? Because I saw four times where you could have just shot from outside the box. I saw at least four. Sometimes it's not going to come easy. Normally, it never does come easy in this league. And it certainly don't come easy in CONCACAF, and that's where we want to be. It may come easy against a team like Simcoe. And you could just walk that shit in. You can't walk that shit in against Kansas City. You certainly can't walk that shit in against Tigres. What the hell are we doing? We were playing in our own stadium. And we played like punks. Well, yeah, I mean, 
Get, what are we get doing? Get back on here. People, I would be... Man, they should have got back. I would have fell back to help him right there. I exactly. One guy should have fell back yeah, I to help cut in. that guy. should have cut in. And you take one corner and I'll take the other. I don't give a shit. Bernadeschi. Go, Bernadeschi. Oh, so. And that ball. Yeah, whatever that was. That's some bullshit. What would happen if Simcoe Rovers beats TFC? Can we get back on Herdman and Manning out? Yeah, if we lose to Simcoe, yeah, no, the the the, the team should be deleted. If we lose to Simcoe, if we lose to a League One Ontario team, delete the damn team. Going forward, and it's in. I mean, I don't why, even know why is he all why is he all the way out there? What what? If I was a coach, I would say, you better stay in this. I don't give a shit. I don't want you out there. You stay in here, and if right. you come out there, I'm firing your ass. That is, did you see how Yeah, he was he, he was out? way too far out. I mean, Long was even back there. I mean, so this one isn't even on a defender. Why was Galron that far out? I, I, I don't even... Oh, no, Lord. why he was already out there. Like, Long was there, too. Like, it wasn't but even, he wasn't even hang out to draw a Lenny score. I don't care about nobody but him. He should have been back there diving and missing it, and I would be fine. He wasn't even back there. Yep. Oh, what by the way. are you doing? Oh, and by the way, let me just clear up. That ball, if he was back on his line, that was not going to go in. That was rolling. If he stays on I, his line, he's probably got that. I get it. I don't know why he thinks he needs to be a player. I have no idea. That's my whole point. Yep. I don't like that. That's just stupid. And when the other now, team does it, it doesn't go our way. If somebody checked it in, yep. he was playing and he was in his box and came out. I know you can come out of the box. Yeah. But he was out there like he was playing. Why are you doing that? Besides, Man. again, and besides, again, a defender was not, he wasn't even hanging out to dry this time. No, that's why I'm saying. Like I'm Long not, was there. I'm not. It's not that he wasn't there. It was why was he there? That makes no sense. Yeah, I can still, I can see it. When we're down, this team, I, I got to say, let me. When this when we're down, I can still see it in this team. Let they don't want to play. Let me say this. I've never played the game. I've played games, and I would never come out of my hole that I was supposed to protect. Right. That is my realm. Right. I'm not coming out. It's like a crab in a shell. I'm right in this motherfucker. You got to come get right. me. Why are they doing that? What the f what was that? Why was he almost to the front? That made no sense. Even I'm I mean, I would never play goalkeeper because I'm only five foot six and I can't jump. Goalkeeper is not matter. where I would play, but they I think I know enough either. not to be off. They ain't doing shit either. I could do that. I could have on mitts and block something if it's hit to my face. Balls to the face. I could do that, but that's not what it is. Right. He wants to play the game. Right. He didn't want to be goalkeeper. I agree. But the thing about Herdman is, is he's definitely more of a motivational guy. But if his tactics don't work, you're screwed. And you can see it right here that tonight it didn't work. And they're screwed. Personally, you need both motivational and technical Look, there, there's some on this mode. Come on now, but get one, but you ain't scoring three. 
in three minutes. No. <laughs> I honestly, I'd rather them lose. If it was me, I'd rather them lose three nil at this point if I was the manager, because I would rather be like, I don't want you to come out and be like, hey, at least we scored one. Because that's, to me, getting a consolation only papers over the cracks. And honestly, after a night like this, I want this to be a learning experience. If I was the manager, I want this to be a learning experience. You think you're going to learn something if it's three to one over three nil? I don't think so. Because you're going to be like, oh, we papered over the cracks. We scored a goal. It just wasn't our night. Okay. See, How about here we go with Eric Tommy? Good job, Tyrese. Good job getting back. You're the only one who actually has gotten back. Good job. Good job. Honestly, the only player that honestly deserves plaudits tonight for TFC legitimately is Tyrese Spicer. No, he did good. He did. Other than that, I. I can't give Oso plot. It's the man felt slow. Coelho, yeah, I mean, you know, I won't hate on him, but he definitely, that midfield was slow tonight. Davey Flores didn't play long enough. As soon as we were down, that's when he came on. Bernadeschi's pushing too hard to try to get something to go when it just ain't going. I'm not saying that in a bad way. I'm just saying he's he's trying to do it all himself, which he kind of has to at this just point. Kick Ryan needs to get Why shit would off. you do that? Just kick that shit. Why would you do that? But wouldn't you agree that Osos look pretty slow tonight? Yeah. I mean, it's... I mean, Coelho and Davey, I guess, both did well, but. Cozy! 89th minute. Shot Bernadeschi! Past the post. See what I mean about Bernadeschi? He's trying to get one anyway. Open his account for the season. He's going too hard. I mean, at least he kicked it. The other ones won't even do that like them. They got to get so close. Just kick that shit. Well. One minute plus stop time think? to go. You think one? Probably two or three. Probably Can you read my last message? Thanks for the one, one, the two bucks. Daniel, what we got? What's your thoughts on the Rock's final boss gimmick? I mean, I like it. I like him as a heel. Honestly, it's better than him playing that fake-ass face gimmick that he's been playing for 15 years. I like Rock as a heel. I actually enjoy Hollywood final boss Rock. I like it. Still want Cody to win the world title, but... Rock's really carrying that feud, I gotta say. So, 90th minute, 3 0 Kansas City. And if you, dad, my dad ain't been watching wrestling, so you don't know, but he's more of a Stone Cold fan anyway. Seven minutes of stoppage time. Wow. What? Wow, that could be the game. No. It was already over. Seven minutes? Well, yeah, dude fell down and, and crabbed and act like he was, he had just been thrown off a 20 foot ladder. Foot Jeff Hardy! 20 story building from the NYPD. Is that no. a Blue Bloods reference? There is, yes. There's no reason there should be seven minutes. I agree. That, that, that is crazy. I'd, I'd honestly be pissed. And the fourth official would be looking at me like, you still have time to come back. I'm like, realistically, no. Why the hell is it seven minutes? <laughs> Just let this be over with. Not three goals. Two to one. Two to four. Possibly. Maybe, we ain't going to come back. Seven minutes, my ass. 
Here comes SKC Mania. What you gonna do, brother, when SKC Mania runs wild on you? Brother. What you doing, Hulkamania? <laughs> hey, somebody else said it. Ooh, eat your yeah. vitamins. Go to school. Aye. Say your prayers and eat your vitamins. Learn something. Don't be a crackhead. Aye. Ooh, yeah. Sn snap into a Slim Jim. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Eat your Slim Jim. Can we you please trade my Lula? And hit a tree. What? Well, I think when that happened, Macho Man already had the heart attack. I think he did. I think he was dead anyway. I think he was eating Slim Jams when that happened. Can we please trade my Lula? It's pretty obvious Herdman doesn't even rate him. Even three goals down, we could try him out. I agree. I like my Lula, but if we're not going to play oh, him, yeah, trade him. Does he have a... Uh... A team that he's trying to trade is, is there uh, the uh, no? They just ain't playing Malula. He's oh. on the roster. They just ain't playing him. I got you. So Herdman doesn't rate him. So if you're not gonna play him, why not trade him? I mean, it's probably easy to trade his and open up some cap space as well. At least get some gam out of it. Yeah. Allocation money out of it, but you're not. Which I I don't know. <laughs> Like, I think my Lula's gotten screwed over. I'd play him, but it's not my decision. If I was the manager, I think I'd give him a shot. But Tyree Spicer is also pretty good, though, so... Ah, I don't know. I'm not a... I mean, MLSE ain't running this team well, or even a second-round draft pick. Okay, now that's pushing it. I don't think we'll do good on a second round draft pick. That's pushing it. Like, I don't know. We could probably trade for a guy like Kervin Ariaga, who I don't know, who's also in the shit at Minnesota. If he ain't a trialist, we could definitely trade for him. Who we sh he should be on the team. I said he would be good for Toronto. Minnesota don't like him anymore. Why not trade for him if he ain't already a trialist and then we could go sign Josh Navarro from Ala Walense 94th minute Definitely take a second round pick. Yeah, we're going to get a TFC2 player with a second round pick. Does he even want to sign? That's the question. Or we'll just stay at what? Freaking Duke or whatever. A free foot coming on for Eric Tommy. With two minutes to go. At least we don't see SKC till 2029 at this rate. That's possible. You're right. Maybe a while. You're right. Maybe a while. Orlando equalizes against Red Bull. Hmm. Shot save, Melia. With a minute and a half to go. Now, this is when I would park the bus. No problem. That's when they need to do that shit, not during the game. Our luck, they probably blow a 3 0 lead doing that. No, I don't think so, but I'm still saying. One minute to go. 3 0, Kansas City. Looks like this is how the game's going to end. It's an MLS, MLSE team that will not go anywhere. 
Now they need a force of nature to go somewhere. That's my point. Who could overcome the bullshit? I thought that was Herdman. Yeah, Turns what? out no. no. What? Go, Come go, on. go. 15 seconds or 20 seconds. Bernadeschi. TFC last score. Jaquiel cross in. Shot goal. Jonathan oh, Osorio you know gets the Dang. consolation. You know what? I'm glad he got it. Good for Oso. Jonathan oh, Osorio. Man. Turns home the cross. That's better than... I'm, you know what? Yep. I'm glad he got that. One to three. MLSE is destroying this amazing club. More like Bill Manning is. This team needs a force of nature to carry them forward. Tactically and motivationally. Maybe, I don't know, a pirate? This team needs to learn how to swing their sword. Full time, oh, it's yeah. one to three. Well, shit. Kansas City wins three to one. Just not our night. Man. But I got a lot of complaints. With that being said, if you like this stream, like it, share, subscribe. You know what it is. Tell your friends. Hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that bell notification if you want to subscribe. Send some chats on live streams. Comment on this video. Put us a play. The share with friends and family. All that great stuff. I'll see you within the hour for the review. Have a happy Easter, everybody. Enjoy the time with your families. And I'll see you next week after, well, the review and then next week. I'm Ron and I'm out. Peace. See you.